Hello everyone, before we look at tonight's video, if I can ask you to give United24 a subscribe on YouTube, we put out great content. Now, let's check out today's video, and it's a pretty cool one. So some of you may have seen this news already, but it's definitely worth covering, I thought. This is all that remains of a building used as a base for Russia in Makiivka. This is literally a welcome to 2023 present. The strike landed at 1 minute past midnight. And as you can see, the building is absolutely flattened. The image on screen now is what it was in happier days. Now this is where troops were based, but that's only the tip of the iceberg. And this here is another example of utmost incompetence. In the basement of this building, where, bear in mind, troops are based and troops are housed, they were also storing ammunition, which is why the building is just a big pile of rubble now. So the troops base here were just sitting on a powder keg waiting to go off. Basically the building version of the um, good old turret toss that we see with T-72s, where the troops actually sit above the ammunition. Casualties aren't known, but are said to be in the hundreds. Here's its location on Google Maps. So pretty sizable compound in the centre of the city. I expect eyes have been on this place for a while, waiting for the best time to strike. Actually... This was probably penciled in as the first target of the new year, start the year with a bang, so to speak. Let's have a look at it on deep states. I've used the artillery tracker to show its range, so you can see this was close to the front, and so well within range of high miles from a number of locations. In addition to the impact of the strike, it shows that still, Russia has no answer to high miles. High miles still gets through without being intercepted. And this is also important because of its location. It's near Donetsk, which is an area of high activity at the moment. So it's definitely good news that these troops and this ammunition is out of the way. So that's it for this video. I hope you found it interesting. If so, please click like and subscribe. I'd appreciate it. Thanks again and take care everyone.